What's up, people? I'm back for another. I guess this is a challenge. It's what? What time is it now? It's oh, it's midnight. <laughs> and I'm gonna try and watch. You know, try. I'm a me. You know, go scare me. Except for snakes. Can't stand snakes. Ah. Oh. But anyway. <laughs> The top five scariest videos on YouTube. My reaction. First time seeing this. It's only 10 minutes, so it shouldn't be that bad. But I don't know. Shouldn't be trying to watch, you know, scary videos at midnight. Um, yeah. What, the light's on, so it sucks. And you're with me. So let's join. Let's 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 tune in and see what this is about. Once again, anything that I have reacted to is going to be in the playlist down in my channel. I was going to say down below. I guess I should put the description down below, maybe, huh? But either way, you can find the video. Top five scariest videos on YouTube. That is, and who is it by? Who is it by? Who we'll put it up? Top five central. Uh oh, duh. All right, so let's get into it. See if it's scary or not. To top five central. Today we're gonna to be taking top a look at central. the top five scariest videos on YouTube. If you haven't already, please feel free to subscribe down below to help us reach 100,000 yeah, yeah, subscribers. Yeah. Also, since I'm we just posted the top five saddest moments on YouTube and Twitch, which if you want to see, you wow. can click right here. But you guys smashed 7,000 likes on that video. So right let's now. see if we try to get 5,000 likes for more videos like this in the future. Anyways, with that said, let's get right into it. Number five, Edward Mascara dancing. If you've ever seen like a sex offender or a pedophile, for the most part, they look like just ordinary citizens and you wouldn't be able to tell the difference. However, everyone has like this ideal image of what they supposedly look like, which is like an old, extremely crazy, psychopathic old man who looks absolutely insane and just looking at them scares the shit out of you. Anyways, one man known as Edward Muscare was a late night show host in the 70s and had the nickname of Uncle Ed, where he pretended to be a vampire. As well, he was the host of a children's TV show. In 1986, Ed was arrested for having sexual contact with a 14 year old boy and was sent to jail for 18 months and was on probation for 10 years. Fast forward 20 years where Ed's living as a registered sex offender, he's released from jail, and he thought it'd be a fun idea to make a YouTube video dancing and singing to songs. I mean, just look at this guy. What would you do if you were walking down the street and this guy, he's the one who offers you some really cool colored Tic Tacs and has a rag covered in chloroform on No, thank you. Anyways, after the video was posted, Ed was arrested again for not reporting to his neighbors that he was a sex offender and would later to go on to die in jail. What makes this video really scary though is, I mean, look at this guy dancing. Although he's, he looks like he's having a great time, like this guy is an actual registered pedophile who's like raped 14 year old kids. Why was that Number creepy? four, Eliza Lamb death that video. Eliza was filmed being in an elevator shaft where she looked extremely paranoid and distressed. You could see what looks like her either going crazy or just extremely terrified. You're probably wondering how this is scary, but the backstory is why this is just absolutely freaky. This video is filmed the day before she went missing in a random hotel. When she went missing, no one knew really where to look until a few weeks later when the hotel guests started noticing the water in the pools and faucets looking a little bit red. So naturally, the hotel staff then went to the roof of the building to go look in the water tank and they found Eliza's body in the water tank, which if you don't know, that's kind of what distributes water to the entire hotel. This video footage is probably the last few moments of us watching Eliza either go batshit crazy and about to commit suicide or a lot of people have been claiming it to be paranormal. Eliza was said to be pretty normal at home and didn't have that many problems that would cause her to commit suicide and jump in a water tank, so I don't know. Number three, okay. crazy woman hiding in apartment. If you're like me where you get randomly hungry or thirsty in the night and you make a trip downstairs to get food, you always think that there's gonna be like a monster, robber, serial killer, or something like that behind you or staring at you. Unfortunately guys, it actually happened to this one guy. He noticed that his food kept disappearing from his fridge and he accused his girlfriend of constantly eating his food, so one day he set up a video camera to catch her doing it. 
it turns out that there was like a teenage girl, like a crazy teenage girl living in his cubby, which if you don't know what that is, it's like a small amount of space you keep your stuff in. Anyways, in the video what? you're about to watch, you're gonna see this crazy chick crawl out of this little tiny area and just braid his fridge. Then later on in the video, he comes out for like a late night snack and she's like in the middle of his living room, so she hides away from him. God damn, this is so creepy. Why not do it when he's gone? Like she real quiet with her shit. Excuse my language. Yo, I don't know what I would do if I this was going on in my house. using the bathroom in the sink. She is just chilling. Oh, snap. Dude, I hope you rinse that cup out. And he ain't see that jug there? Number two, sculpting Yo, gone crazy. horribly wrong. So this one is just in general, probably one of the creepiest things you'll see on YouTube. It doesn't have like a murder or paranormal background as it was confirmed to be just an art project, but what this guy creates is horrifying. Essentially, he just like sculpts a mask out of clay and makeup and stuff like that, but does it on his face. And what he creates looks like something you'd see in a Texas Chainsaw Massacre movie and is honestly just so creepy. I personally hate looking at this thing because just imagine this thing chasing you with a chainsaw. I, I definitely wouldn't be too fond of that. Oh, I don't know what this is. This is crazy.
Number one, possessed makeup tutorial. What starts out as like a seemingly innocent video turns into one of the scariest, most unexpected video ever. It's just a normal makeup tutorial that this chick is doing and then my god, the bitch starts beating the shit out of herself. Like, uh, Jesus, all right, you know what? Just play the clip. It freaks me out just looking at it. Just play the clip. Side, make sure you have full coverage. Gorge. Oh my God, do you see how pretty that looks? Pretty. Now we're gonna take it to our little stunted brush. This is what I like to call it because it has shorter bristles here, so it's better for the contouring. Work it, work, work. Fabulous. And we're gonna move over to our mascara, which is our final touch, and I like to use and yeah, we're gonna just get started on our mascara. And I love to start at the base and then move my way inside. So we're gonna just start here. So anyways, that's our list of the top five scariest videos on YouTube. Be sure to let us know in the comment section if you guys have any top five suggestions you'd like to see in the future, and we might just do them. Also, if you haven't already, we recommend you subscribe to us on another Yo. one. That was creepy. Very creepy. I don't like stuff like that. But why did I watch that? I don't like stuff like that. That was silly. Let's go. Let's let's find some. <laughs> let's let's find some funny videos to watch now. I don't like that. Ugh. Yo, that was wild. Well, anyway, on that note, I'm done. Yep, I'm. Done. <laughs> Thanks for joining me. I'm out.